Jess Conley's in for Keith tonight, and we are headed for the deep freeze. Yeah, it's going to be very cold as we get into tonight, especially, and then again tomorrow night with the wind chills. It could feel as cold as 25 below zero. So if you are out and about, make sure you're protecting your skin. It only takes less, it can take less than 30 minutes to uh, have frostbite set in when it's that cold. So just be careful. Clear skies tonight. We'll let temperatures cool off as we go through the overnight hours. Our temperatures right now are cooling off already 20 in Portland. It's 18 in Lewiston. Augusta's at 17. Bangor now at 19 degrees, but with the wind out there, it feels even colder in many locations. Winds gusting now to around 20, 25 miles an hour in some spots, especially into northern Maine. This is what it feels like with the wind chill. Feels like nine in Bangor. Look at northern Maine already feeling like it's below zero. It feels like seven in Portland, and it feels like just four in Augusta. And these wind chill values will drop as we go into tonight and tomorrow morning as well. So let's talk about tomorrow. We'll start with temperatures in the single digits and low teens. We're going to have plenty of sun for the day. It looks nice and bright, but it's going to stay nice and cold to our high temperatures tomorrow. Make it into the low to mid 20s. We will see a couple clouds as we head into tomorrow afternoon. Shouldn't be a big deal though. Then as we go overnight Friday into Saturday, those air temperatures fall back into the single digits again with the wind chill going to be even colder than that. So again, stay warm as we go into the weekend. Saturday's high temperatures stay chilly again. We're only in the low to mid 20s for highs. We'll see some sunshine early. Then clouds increase though as we go into Saturday night because some snow is on the way for late Saturday and into early Sunday. We'll look at that in just a second. Uh, looking at the wind chill overnight into early Friday, you can see we're all at or below zero for the most part very early Friday. Then again for Saturday, definitely a chilly start to the day. Cold, I shouldn't say chilly. It's just cold, so make sure you're again dressing warm. Don't forget about your pets either. Temperatures stay way below normal as we head into early next week. Maybe there's a chance by the middle of next week to rebound a little bit. Some light snow early on Sunday, then that wraps up as we head into Sunday afternoon, but there's still a chance for some big snowfall Tuesday into Wednesday. We'll keep our eye on that. Seas tomorrow, two to three feet winds from the northwest, 10 to 20 knots gusting as high as 30 knots. So plenty of sun tomorrow. That's great, but temperatures only will be able to make it into the low to mid 20s. Pretty much the same thing for the day on Saturday. It's going to stay chilly through the weekend. Sunday's high temperatures are only in the mid to upper 20s. With that light snow around on Sunday morning, too, things could be a little bit slick on the road, so be careful. If you're out skiing or enjoying it uh, this weekend or even into early next week, just make sure you're dressing nice and warm. And again, keep your skin uh, covered and protected. Sun and clouds for Monday and then watching that storm. Getting excited about it for Tuesday into Wednesday. Could see some double-digit snowfall totals, guys. Wow. Thank you, Jess.